Back at it, we have uh, we have Whiskey Cola being released tonight. Back. Thursday, uh, it is August 4th, mm-hmm. 8 p.m., Whiskey Cola is released. Now, uh, I've been waiting to say this, so make sure we clip this piece up here, okay? I've been waiting to discuss why Whiskey Cola disappeared mm-hmm. and why it's back on the market and how we got to know Jack Daniels very well. <laughs> so, whenever we released Whiskey Cola years ago... Whenever we were first talking about it, for everybody that doesn't know, Mike, Bob, and myself love Jack and Diets. Mm -hmm. That's like our drink of choice. We love Jack Daniels and Diet Cokes. That's just our drink. Whenever we go somewhere, Jack Jack and Diet. Diet. Whenever we go to a restaurant, we do Old Fashions, we do Jack and Diets. We will judge the fuck out of your restaurant and you as a bartender through Jack and Diets. Yep. How are the Jack and Diets? Like, that's a question. When someone goes to a restaurant and we're not all together... How were the Jack and Diets? Yep. Or I can even remember what places that I loved their Jack and Diets. Mm-hmm. I, it's just how we do things and write things. So we're big Jack Daniels people. Now, whenever we were little old Axe and Sledge starting out, mm-hmm. being excited, and we're like, hey, you know, it'd be a pretty cool fucking flavor if we did like a Jack and Diet flavor. It'd be great. Let's do Jack and Diet flavor. And uh, we're like, well, you know, we can't call it fucking Jack and Diet, dickheads. Yeah. You're like, yeah, we'll call it whiskey cola. <laughs> yeah. We'll see, if, we'll see if they can do it. We'll see if we can nail a flavor. So went to our manufacturer and said, hey, this is our idea. And they're like, are you guys fucking serious? And we're like, dead serious. Send us the fucking flavor. So we got in a bunch of different samples. And then we tweaked them. And it actually tasted pretty fucking good. Like, we're like, hey, yeah. this tastes like a, like a bottle cap. Mm-hmm. Like, a, like a, um, a gummy bottle cap. Cola bottle cap. Yeah. With like, uh, like a, a little added cola flavor with somehow incorporating a whiskey flavor Mm -hmm. i'm like hey this is actually like a refreshing grind it's unique yep and we love our unique flavors well next came the label we're like what should we do so we decided to uh to come up with a label that may have uh symbolized another company yeah and we're like fuck yeah we're young we're excited about a product we're like fuck yeah let's just go with it (laughs) so we came out with the product and it turned out to sell unbelievably well. Mm-hmm. We sold a fuckload of whiskey cola mm-hmm. with that label on it. Mm-hmm. Sold a ton. Mm-hmm. Like, everybody loved it. It was big in Australia. It was big everywhere. The flavor is phenomenal. Well, it got so big, and Axe and Sledge grew very quickly to becoming what it, we are now. Mm-hmm. Massive company in the industry. It's hard not to know Axe and Sledge. And... uh Jack Daniels found out about Whiskey Cola, mm-hmm. and they were not too happy with the label design. Mm-hmm. So their legal department reached out to us. and um, Very nice. They were super, super nice people. Mm-hmm. Tremendous. Mm-hmm. We told them what big fans we were. Yes. We were, that was one of the first things we told them. We're like, hey, excited to hear from you, big fans. First and foremost, first and foremost. really great job on, <laughs> on <laughs> developing a world-renowned whiskey. Yeah. We love it. We're big fans. And uh, they quickly told us to shut the fuck up. Mm-hmm. Um, they don't care. <laughs> um, and then we asked for, we just we just wanted to keep the conversations going, mm-hmm. you know. And uh, they said, please stop selling it. And we're like, do we have to? Yes, you have to. Yeah, we had to make sure. Yeah, we had to. Do <laughs> <laughs> you expect us not to push the envelope a little bit? We're like, yeah, it's, hmm, no, don't look anything like it. And they're like, yeah. Yeah, I think it's time. We're like, okay, good idea. You got it, guys. Yep. So then we had to uh, discontinue the flavor mm-hmm. because uh, we tried many times to relabel it quickly, mm-hmm. come up with a new design, and uh, they quickly shot everything down and told us, cut the bullshit. Mm-hmm. I'm glad you guys are big fans. Thank you for telling us in the 12th fucking email. But time to go. <laughs> so we're like, okay. All right. So we stopped yep. and discontinued the product. Um, and recently we spent a lot of time on redoing the label and creating our own image with it. Um, and we have been super excited for this release for a long time. We've been sending out, we sent out all those boxes to everybody. Um, super cool to see everything. The box is sick. Mm -hmm.